following a 4 and 12 season in 2022 and the fact that the Panthers have had a losing record in six of their last seven seasons, Panthers ownership felt it was in their best interest to relocate. One bid came in from a city with a 650,000 population and a love for sports and blues music, Memphis, Tennessee. They decided on the Egyptians as their name given Memphis was the name of one of the first ancient cities of Egypt. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Memphis Egyptians. Welcome to Memphis. TD, I got you. Baker Mayfield going crazy, throwing lasers. TD on the sticks, you know what can save you. Still form from forming, got him staggering and dropping like he just took a punch from forming. Yeah, can't nobody do nothing with me. And my defense looking sharp like the claws of a Memphis Grizzly. Crowd going wild, screaming my name. Big sack, Brian Burns, lead the field in flames. Insane, we stand tall like the pyramids. Go ahead and get the trophy ready for the Memphis Egyptians. Please don't bump out the MVK. Teague experience. Okay, I think Teague's a fan favorite. Is Teague your guys' favorite player? Okay, this is my comment question. They also kill the like button because if you want more Memphis Gyms, if you want this renewed for another season, 6,000 likes in this video, renew it for another season, please. I love this stuff. In all my franchises that I got going on right now, Packers, Bears, all of them, who's your guys' favorite player and why? You don't have to say Teague. I'm not even like just saying like trying to probe. I just, me right now, I'm all about the Enrique Teague experience. Like I, this, this is all I'm about. This, this is, this is everything to me. Enrique Teague's rookie season, 958 on the ground, 3,000 through the air. Enrique Teague is the coolest player I've ever had. Five foot nine. No one believed in him. Enrique Teague is freaking different. Um, but Enrique Teague is about to have a freaking battle against an AFC powerhouse in Lamarvelous Jackson. I just got plus one speed. Oh my gosh, Jeremy Chin. That is ridiculous. Um, we're about to have a battle. We got offered probably the craziest trade I've ever seen for Enrique Teague. Um, I can't... So many guys in this league are so jealous of the Teague experience. I just can't. W would I be lying if I said this wasn't the most intriguing deal I've ever seen in my life? Yeah. Oh, no, it's not. Debo's not superstar. Debo is superstar. That's a much more intriguing deal. Yeah, no, that's not. We're not, we're not taking that. Sorry, bro. Sorry. It, it was a good trade. Nick Bose is good. Um, but yeah, no, not happening. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, the Dolphins continue to decline. We, we, I have, I've been working on a deal with Tyree Kill. Um, the Dolphins are number, they're the number one seed, but they need to get better on defense. I'm like, hey, bro, let me help you. Let me help you. you you're going to get stops against London and TSAP. I can help you on the DB side of thing. You already got Jalen Waddle. Send me some speed. I'll send you DJ. He's just he's making it difficult. We haven't really come to an um, agreement at this point. So we're, I'm, I'm at a standstill with him completely in terms of just like where our trade talks are. Show you guys the Ravens roster. This is, uh, this is Ernest. This is Lamar versus Teague, bro. Bateman. He's got Tyrese McCord. I look at this, the, this though, like man press. His defense is absolutely insane. It's going to be Marlon Branch and Enrique Teague versus the world in this game. That, that's my plan. That's how I plan on running this. Let's go Sende. Be great. Enrique Teague is currently um, the second highest uh, graded runner in the league and one of the best players. Camera died. Let's go. They go play action here on first down. Come on, Pierman. Good job, Pierman. Okay. Okay. Yeah, th th this dude's definitely no joke, man. The one thing about Earns definitely earned a lot of respect, no pun intended, in this league. Yeah, it's like, he's, just, he's gonna freaking just shoot that gap every time. Again. Oh, gosh. Good defense. They'll try and throw for it here. Going for the deep ball. It's a bad drive. Trying a new playbook probably shouldn't be. It's a bad drive. Jackson on the give to Dobbins. And room there to wait. Plenty of hurries given up. So now what do you do on offense? You just max protect, keep everyone in, and Book, books, 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 books. Go home, CJ. Help out Teague. Help out Teague. Well done. Okay. Teague, when we get the ball back. We got it. We can be a lot more smart. A lot smarter is the word that I'm actually looking for. Not more smart. But that 
That was not good. That was not good. First drive, I'm embarrassed of, but we bounce back. If they can take better care of the football this go around. And sometimes, pardon, I think it's almost better that you... He's got a man! Dang, Chin. Oh, we knew it was coming, too. Oh, we knew it was coming. Oh, ah, that's what that's what stings the most on that one. JC. No, sir. Wheeler. Good job, Wheeler. I know how stubborn Ernest is. I know how stubborn Ernest is. Dang, good throw. Oh, that's two on that drive. I thought Jeremy. Okay, main moral of the story, though, guys, is our offense needs to be better. Our offense did not execute in that first uh, bit. I got sacked. I was struggling with the read option game. I'm trying a different playbook. This is just kind of a test. I've flown a different playbook. I've ran the other playbook so many times against Ernest where it's like, it's tough to go to it, but as of right now, the other playbook's not looking good. But that can change. That can all change really fast. Good hit. Third and seven. Like I said, this is going to be a battle. I'm not, I'm not going home yet. I'm having a horrible start, but I'm, I'm not going home yet. Brett, you're like the worst at that. Like, I, there's nobody worse than that in me. Than me. Oh, my gosh. Why can't I catch a pick? But instead, it's fourth down. Tucker's kick is good. As the offense comes out here, Charles, uh, maybe perhaps a bit more of a focus. Help him out, Marlon. Help him out. He's going to run dollar every single play. Let's just make him pay, please. Can we please just make him pay if he's going to run dollar every play? Because after you throw an interception, you want to make sure you keep your quarterback. On play action. T. Beam. Drop it. They're gonna try and throw. I don't know why I ran a new playbook. This is one that we're gonna forget about. If I lose, we're gonna forget about it. I, I, I've never ran this freaking playbook, and I am paying for it right now so bad. Now it's Jackson. Come here. Defense is going to show up for us. One thing's for sure. The defense is not just... We're, we are a good enough team to even when our offense is playing how our offense is playing right now. Our defense can help us win games. And that's I, precisely what we're seeing right now. Throwing is Jackson. That this offense is aggressive. We saw that last drive. They just get our confidence up a little bit. Let's just start with something simple. Get our confidence up. Come on, Bush. Beam. Let's go. Good stuff, Brett. And he takes this one down almost all the way to the 30. We got no quitting us. It's not in our DNA. He's gonna keep this again. And he will well done, T. Okay, get seven before half. Looking to throw. T. He'll be hit and taken down at the 21. Already down two scores. They're gonna go for this rather than settle for three. Beam! T! Come on, man! I just felt momentum-wise I had to send it there. I felt like we just were having the worst start of a game all season. I felt like momentum-wise. 
Let's go take some of this momentum back, is how I was thinking. I was like, if I settle for three there, and I'm still down seven, not getting ball, and he's got a minute and 21, I am, I'm telling him that, yeah, I suck. Don't want that. Let's go. Beam from Teague. We're back. Jackson now. He's going to sling this deep downfield. And that's caught inside the 30. And he'll be taken down at the... Not sure this D knows what hit him, but now they got to get ready. It's first and goal. And this is caught. Defense takes the field to begin the opening drive of the second half, Charles. Remember that first half, good through the air and really all around an outstanding offensive performance. And that is going to be sudden, they've got a first down in the red zone. And he's going to be brought down. Oh, my gosh. Jackson with good job, Burns. Three here is actually helpful. He may go for this, and three keeps this a two-score game. If he scores, it's a three-score game, and there's not a lot that I can do. That's all right. Okay, pull it down. He takes three. We're in it. Three keeps us in it. Yes, sir. Okay, Teague, we got a chance, bro. Teague, how do is this our legacy game? Is this going to be the Teague legacy game that we will talk about in three years? Yes or no? I think this is about to be the Teague legacy game. Where he was boxed the entire first half. Everybody doubted him. Ravens fans were making fun of him. And he comes back with the most brilliant second half. Of all time, I think we are on the like what could be a memorable T game. I'm not even just saying this. I think this is going to be a T moment, heritage moment. Their deficit a little wider now than it was at halftime following the field goal a moment ago. But the goal is still the same because it's a good throw. It's a good throw, Enrique. It's a good throw. Off the play fake, T. Beam. Is this the Teague game? Yeah, hey, everyone has their legacy game. Everyone has the game that people remember. Is this, are we witnessing Teagues right now? Oh, he missed him. Keep the Teague. I missed the house, my guy. He dropped it. He picked it up. Thank God. He was fortunate there. Luck was on his side, able to recover that fumble. And on fourth and inches. On fourth down. T. <sighs> the T game, man, I'm telling you. You might be witnessing it right now. <sighs> Stay locked in. That's all I'm going to say to myself. Stay locked in. Stay locked in. Stay locked in. Defense, we have allowed big plays on like every drive. If we can limit the big plays, I just don't see him stopping us. I, or like, I don't see him being successful. We gotta limit those though. Right now, I'm not playing smart. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Is this the T game? Is this the T game? Freaking Memphis, come on. Here's Jackson to throw. He's gonna air one out. Kalen Barnes. Kalen Barnes. He was ready for that one. Okay. Okay, defense, we gotta stop him again. Oh, this is such a messy game. It, it, this really is the messiest game ever. Oh. Kalen Barnes again. 
Kalen Barnes again. Okay. Teague, we need something, bro. Teagan. Let's actually. I just don't have any good runs. Like, I don't know why. I, mean, I have no good runs for. Oh, I have no good runs at all. Come on, Marlon. Go win a game for us, Marlon. Go, Marlon! Go, Marlon! Come on, Kyle Hamilton. Come on. Come on, Kyle Hamilton. Plus eight. John and Kate. Let's go. Come here. Come here, Lamar. Jackson. Looking for Bateman. He's got him complete. And way up past. Off the play fake to Dobbins. Here's Jackson. That ball caught. It's Mark Andrews, the tight end. First and 10. As they've got things rolling on this drive. Yeah, he's gonna get a solid gain of nine before being brought down second and right. Thing is, do we really want to get into a situation with Lamar Jackson? A Lamar Jackson two point? Is that where we want to be? He's gonna kill clock on him. You already know this though. Third down. He's gonna try and make this the final possession. And he he wants to score and go to OT against us. Respect it. Off the play fake. Here's Jackson. But your box, Lamar. No way. Oh my goodness. Let's make him let's make him win here. Let's make him win. So another stop. One fifty left in the football game. I don't necessarily know that I'm going to run from it, but I don't know that I'm not. Let's just make, do everything we can to make sure he has to pass it. Kalen Barnes. A lot of hate for the Kalen Barnes signing. I remember it. Nope. Earn, you are insane. Oh my gosh. Literally pump fakes it. That's out of bounds. Can I get a booth review on that one, please? Am I able to get a booth review on that? He doesn't have it. If, if he caught that, I was quitting. He's going onside, which is interesting because then I can get a five. I'm surprised he's going onside time-wise. I just, I am a little surprised because now I have a guaranteed, most likely a guaranteed three here. I'm gonna try and mind game. I want to see what he. I want to see if he notices that Marlon Branch is at receiver. I don't know. I don't think he did. I don't think he did. I don't think he did. That's that's a coach of the year type play, fellas. That's a coach of the year type play. GG's in the chat. Legacy, fellas. Legacy. Legacy, Teague. Legacy. GG's in the chat, fellas. Horrible start. Oh, he is. He's playing it up. Horrible. Absolutely horrible start to that game. Great second half. Defense, Kalen Barnes was MVP. Kalen Barnes actually made it really difficult for him at Um Kalen Barnes was unbelievable. Teague, I threw some dots when I needed to. He had a couple touchdowns at the end of the game. Marlon Branch showed up like he always does. You guys already know all about Marlon Branch, so I don't have to tell you about that. And then, hey, that's GG's against the top. That's Lamar. I won't go back to that offense. That'll, that'll be my last time in that offense, but... Overall, the dubs. Dubs, bro. That's all, that's all it's about, man. It's all about the dubs. That's what we're here for. GG's, fellas. GG's. Legacy, bro. It's Teague is just writing his legacy. Like, horrible start. How does he respond? He comes out and he beats Lamar in the second half. 12 for 23. 
throws two touchdowns, gets it to DJ Moore, gets it to Pierman, laser on fourth down to Marlon Brand. Legacy games, fellas. Legacy games. Horrible. Everything went wrong in that first half. But on this day, we were better. As simple as that. On this day, we were better. And Enrique T, another freaking upgrade. Uh, I'm going to keep going scrambler with him. He's gotten like two throw powers already. Uh, plus one break that sack. He's an 84 strong arm. Hey, if he, if he gets rookie of the year, if he gets something, we're going to get an award. We got the Bucks next week. You guys already know about the Bucks. I don't have to tell you about the Bucks. They're crazy, but I think we do most likely with that win, I think we got a good chance to take the division. So, <laughs> GG's. The Bucks actually wasn't able to play for like three days. Um, so I ended up getting a force win in that game. League had to move on. Guys, so we ended up getting the win. We're 12-2. and two. This trade has been the longest trade negotiation I've ever ever had in my entire life um i think me and this guy probably like 800 dms went into this into working out this deal making this deal right for both of us and it was a deal that i was hard to make there's pieces in this that are difficult but essentially guys we are we're making a deal we we were making a deal for tyree kill um when he went on the block at the beginning of the season i messaged him I, we, we just couldn't come to an agreement. This is the type of player that Memphis needs. This is the type of guy to put us in a spot to win in Memphis. I get he's 32 years old, but it's freaking Tyree Kill. If I can even get one, if I can get the end of this year and next year with him being Tyree Kill, it is a worth it trade. 100%. I think with Fountain of Youth, if I use, I've saved up. This is the part of the reason I am doing this trade. And I'm going to explain this right now. Part of the reason this trade is happening is because of something called Fountain of Youth. Now, with Fountain of Youth, I have not used it. As soon as I trade him, I can use that to slow the regression. Let me show you guys the trade that was worked out over the span of about 14 days. Ladies and gentlemen, it is DJ Moore, Jeremy Chin, Dante Jackson for Tyreek and his first. Absolute blockbuster. Let's talk about it. DJ Moore I love. Um... I really do, but he's just not, he's really good at a lot of things, not great at a lot of, like, he's just not, he's not a burner, you know, and I feel like on this team, we're lacking a burner, I have, I have Pierman and Divins, and like, if I have Tyree Kill, I can have Divins on the field all the time and give him a chance, but with Moore, he's just not fast enough to really make people, like, when we lost in the Super Bowl, I was man-pressed every single play, and DJ Moore wasn't getting open. He is 29 years old. He's a beast. Love him, but he is going to be in, involved in this trade. The next piece, probably the most difficult piece, and this is the one that took ages, is the Jeremy Chin factor of the trade. Um, Jeremy Chin's... This is why the trade's happening and how I'm getting the trade. Jeremy Chin might be the best user in the game. Um, I suck at user. I am a very self-aware person. I do not get a lot of lurks. I do not get a lot of picks. I user drop all these picks. I know I'm good at making adjustments. I am not always the brightest bulb in the bin when it comes to actually picking the ball off. Now, the reason you make a trade like this is because I have Terrence Bramble, who I want to re-sign. I want to put him in Jeremy Chin's spot. I believe in Terrence Bramble. My camera battery did just died. One second. Okay, I'm back. So Terrence Bramble, I believe in. Um, as a coverage guy... As just an awareness guy, he's going to play in that spot. But the main reason I can get rid of Chin is because we do have Darnell Savage, bro. Um, I got Savage for a few more years. He, like, equally, if you're looking at production, I had nine picks with him in my first year, four this year, or four the year after, and then two this year and four and a half sacks. Savage is equally as good of a user. So, like, I can pretty quickly go from Chin to Savage and not see a huge thing. The other guy is Dante Jackson now. He is kind of taking a smaller role. We've got such good DBs. I love him. He's been on this team for a while. But Dante Jackson is just like, he's old, bro. He's 30 years old. That speed, I I honestly, if we're talking Tyree Kill, I think he's regressing. I think he goes down. And this is part of the reason I want to get rid of him. At 31, oftentimes, the loser. If he goes down to 94 speed, he almost has no value. So... I got Barnes, who's having an absolute freaking just phenomenal year for us. Barnes has been ridiculous. 11 interceptions this season. Like, Kalen Barnes was the most talked about 
like, oh, Brett, you're crazy. And then Kalen Barnes just decided to like have a defensive player of the year type season. Also, like, and the reason I, I'm, I'm getting his first round pick. So it's going to be late. Like I said, the guy we're trading with is actually at the top of his side. He's the number one seed on that side. He's got Jalen Waddell. He's been trying to get rid of Hill. Guys, without further ado, let's just freaking accept it. Ladies and gentlemen, the new face of Memphis, the new guy on the pamphlet. Ah, oh, and the coolest guy I know, bro. Such a good dude. Like, just I, I've done. I've probably played him like ten times in Madden. He's just he's a like he's a nice guy. He he really really like. It just like in I, the brief encounters I have with him, he's just like a funny, nice guy. Um, and he's on our team, dude. This is the face of Memphis football. I gotta go change his jersey number. I'm gonna look, but this is something that I, I think is gonna help us. We got depth, bro. Avion, like people forget about Avion. Like he's gonna be the guy who jumps in there to replace Dante, but I think he can. Like I'll put him at say like. With JC, CJ, and Barnes, like we're the world is our oyster, bro. Like that, that's enough. Obviously, I'm hurting a little bit now at safety, but I just like to me the first thing you do after making a move like that is you try and find a way to get Terrence Bramble back. Like that's kind of where my head goes. Like you know what? That's that's where you go. You you get Terrence Bramble back because you need him. Um, Johnny Hecker, I apologize. You're about to lose your jersey number. You're great. You're gonna lose your jersey number. Nothing you did wrong. West Alabama, baby. West Alabama's finest. Oh, like I said, this is it, bro. This is freaking it. Tyreek Hill experience, route technician, everything. And guys, his debut game is going to be against none other than, and I'm not playing this right now, but you guys are going to see this in like two seconds. It's going to be ET versus ET, the ET bowl. Guys, grade the trade. What do you guys think? I think it's a 10 out of 10 trade. I could not be happier. I, I literally... And now we get to play against the guy with the most passing yards in the NFL, Evan Thomas, who's having a great year. And I can't believe, guys, let's dance, bro. Tyreek Hill. Plays a boom, fellas, Tyreek! Bro, this is the game, okay? Can we just hashtag the game? There is so much to this game. This is Enrique T versus Evan Thomas. 8.20 p.m., night game, under the lights, Debut for Tyree Kill. This is the most, I would say in my franchise history, and you can correct me if I'm wrong, this is the most anticipated game ever. Don't at me, don't talk to me. I There has never been a game to me that matters as much. We have a bunch of upgrades. Obviously, you guys saw the Tyree T Hill trade. I cannot wait for that. Oh my gosh, Marlon Branch just got plus one speed. Holy freaking doly. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's unbelievable. Jamal Pierman's almost 85 overall, which is what I've been waiting for since I got Jamal Pierman. And he gets plus one speed. Holy, is today my day? One away from edge protector with Akeem Ekwanu. Um, he gets plus two pass block finesse. Ladies and gentlemen, let's talk, bro. I, I don't even know. Oh, in case I didn't mention the Bucks, I know I already talked about that. Guys, Evan Thomas. Has a special place in my heart. Also, like, just freaking Tyree Kill. I don't, I don't even know what else to say. But Evan Thomas has a very, very, very special... Where is he? Has a very, very, very special place in my heart. He really does. Um, this guy's got him to an 82 overall superstar out of Purdue. You guys remember we drafted this guy um, two years in Memphis. Ended up trading him. To go with Enrique Teague, he's having a great year. 30 touchdowns, 11 interceptions. He's led the team to a 10-4 record. And he is going to be playing across from freaking Enrique Teague, who's having the rookie of the year, year of the year. Dude is just playing out of his mind. 38 touchdowns, 15 picks, almost 1,000 on the ground. Guys, this is the most anticipated matchup of all time. Don't at me. Don't talk to me. Don't even look at me. This is easily the most anticipated matchup I've ever seen. Route Tech and Route Apprentice are going to be my two for Tyreek Hill. Tyreek's on the squad, bro. I, you, you, like, I just, I have no words for how excited I am for the Tyreek Hill debut. The first thing that I'm going to do right now, though, um, before it gets weeks, is we got, we got a huge game next week against the Chiefs as well. We got big games to finish out this season. Um, 
I want to use my fountain of youth on wide receiver. Boom. I want it to be on Tyree Kill. Guys, I can talk for days. Um, E.T. versus E.T. Showdown. Tyree Kill debut. Holy. I got to redo my depth chart because of the trade. But I'll see you guys in a minute. We're happening. Ah, let's go, man. Let's go. I'm going to throw this ball really, really quick. I just want to get some confidence for Teague. I'm just going to get this ball to Marlon Branch. Just get it to Marlon Branch first play. He's got a new speed boost. See what he's playing on defense. This guy's notoriously, he's a, he's been in the AFC Championship a few times. He's good. Um, Tyreek Hill over there. Ah, I want to freaking scream. That's so cool. Why are we lagging like that? Ooh. That's not a good start. They're indeed going for it as they look to throw. Flush to his right. Teague, bro. Freaking Teague, man. We really like fatigue. Yo, shut him up, Teague. Shut him up, man. Come on. Good job, Enrique. Enrique's different, bro. Back to throw. Teague. Enrique's just playing at a different level than everybody right now. That's a that's a deal. That's Bush. Okay, we're dealing with a little bit of lag right now, which uh, is not ideal, unfortunately. There's not much I can do about it. Me and this guy, I think he's I know I think he's in uh, New York area. Good job, Marlo. Good job, Marlo. And he'll get on first down. T. Come on, Ty. Come on, Ty! Go up, Reek! First catch as a Memphis Egyptian, the new face of Memphis. I'm recording this, right? I, I, I'm like, my, my, my equipment's all messed right now. Yeah, Marlon Branch up top, baby. Let's go. Let's go, Brown. Hey, Evan Thomas, get on the field. Get on the field, Evan. I'm here. I am here. Get on the field, Evan freaking Thomas. 7-0. Perfect drive. That Enrique Teague play uh, was absolutely banana. That was everything that Enrique Teague is. That third down conversion. Then we throw two dots. Marlon Branch does his thing, and we're up 7-0. Okay. Whew. Defense, be great today. Evan suits Cleveland so well. Like, Evan Thomas is a perfect fit here. He really is. So well. Like, he really, really, really does. Yo, who on the planet is that? That running back's bananas. Good run. Holy moly. Get a couple of first downs, run some plays. I know where you want to throw that ball to, bro. I'm there. I'm waiting for it. That's Jose Wheeler. That's why I could not get rid of Wheeler. I know exactly where you want to throw that ball to, Evan. Come here. Terrence Bramble. Oh. Like I said, Terrence Bramble is going to be getting a lot more opportunities as a, like, run stopper. Like, a lot, a lot more. Shot teams right there. Going deep here for Evan didn't Hopkins. see Sermon. Evan didn't. And this is caught inside the five. And it'll take from the gun on Come on, Ty. One guy. One guy to beat, Ty. Four for one. They're gonna try and throw. Yeah, go Marlo! Go Marlo! One block. First down. Yo, this is a freaking game, dude. I can honestly say I've never cared more about a game than this one right here. We're playing good football right now. We're playing no mistake football, which is the most important thing. He's he's had great like option defense on Teague, but I need to like get him out of that. I need to get him to the point where he's no longer playing the option. And like here, for example, I need to get him to the point where he's not no longer moving everybody back on Tyree Kill. Like you're good, Teague. Different. Oh my gosh. Oh, did you see that? Rewatch that if you didn't see it. Pyramid and uh, and Divins ran into each other. That's tough. 
they literally ran into each other. I had him on a corner route that I thought was going to be pretty well perfect for that situation. I still stand by the fact that it was a, it was a pretty good call. Horrible result. Thank defense. We got to step up, fellas. We got to step up. It's not how we play. We don't just make adjustments at halftime if you're a good football team. You spend that time on the sideline, you start. And yeah, we'll find out here soon enough whether those adjustments are enough defensively. This one swung out here to Jones. A good. Yeah, I guess right. Running right, here's Brown. And just good down. I did run commit that way. That's a good call on his part. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. Good job by Evan. Okay. I, I did not expect that slam from the outside guy. That was really well played. Okay, offense, we got to be better, fellas. That's, uh, that's pretty much as simple as I can put it. I feel like I had the correct read on that play. Um, where everything went bad, but doesn't matter if they run into each other. Got to get seven here before happen. I got to be somewhat smart with the clock to not give him the full clock going into this. Like, that's, I think the most important thing is to just not give him a ton of time come on Teague the Teague formation baby the Teague formation go Teague Ooh. I needed that I needed that to go oh gosh that was one block love you Pyramid love you Pyramid love you love you love you love you Ooh, okay, he's playing really good defense right now. He's doing a good job with a lot of this stuff. Come on, Marlon. Teague, Teague, Ty. Three kill. Let's go, man. Welcome to Memphis. TD, I got you. Let's go. Defense, play football. Defense, let's go play better football. I, I know we can stop Evan. I know. We know Evan. Nobody knows us better than Evan. Nobody. We can stop him. That was a beauty of a dot right there. Teague finds Tyreek, and we got a 14-14 game. Let's dance. Put something together here. Try to take that lead into intermission. I would have to think yeah, bro. that would be the goal for sure. I don't think you sit on anything here. He's got a man complete. Put him inside third there. I'm oh, sure I did. Dang. Throwing to start the drive. Team. One tackle to beat. Oh, gosh. Complete. Throwing on first down. T. Eluding the pressure right. And going deep for Hill. And this is caught inside the five. Touchdown. Tyreek Hill. The Teague Bull, baby. The E.T. Bull. Let's go. Beam to Tyreek. Oh my gosh. This is as he, it's as advertised right now. Tyreek is as advertised. Like worth every penny of what we spent for him. Oh, okay, 21 up. How well Evan Thomas fits with this guy's scheme. Oh, I thought I thought that was a pass. Here comes the blitz as they look to throw. Throwing for his running back, and he's got him complete. Finding room. Looking to throw. T. They're going deep for Hill. And this is caught inside the five. A final shot before break. Safety valve here. That's complete. And he'll be brought down right on the edge. To throw once more on second and ten. Thomas. And he comes back with back to throw. Thomas. This is complete to Watkins on the slam. Gotta play more aggressive. On first down, Thomas. There it is. Pressure we'll stop, is be taken down. Off the play fake. Thomas. He caught that. Is Denzel Mims. Now Thomas throwing on fourth down. Wide open. Third and ten. Again, he'll drop to throw. Drops it to Jones in the flat. 
Can't get off the field, bro. Down here, should up the intensity a couple more times and get off the field before giving up any more yardage. And he will reach the eight. Second down and goal. Thomas. Come on. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Et. That's the et I know. That's the Evan Thomas I know. Good defense. Okay. Hey, we've played good offense all day. Tyreek's activated. Um, Jose Wheeler forces the fumble. Nothing makes me happier than all that exact sequence of events. All in one. Beautiful. Okay, I just want to get the ball to tie here, bro. So bad. Marlon is so bad. This is not bad. Looking to throw. T. And that's going to be incomplete. I just think it was all right. I gotta add minimum try. It's crazy to think that you do this in this situation, but like my red zone defense is one of the best parts of my defense. So it's like it's difficult for me to not at least try. They'll try and throw for it here. Yeah. Play red zone again. Dang, couldn't get the run going. That's tough. They'll start out here with the option left. And he's in. As yes, we saw that last drive, they went for it on fourth down, didn't get it. Then they give up the touchdown. So now you feel like they really need to respond here. But that's caught at the 25. The throw, ET. And they're going to get this down. Get seven, try and stop him. Get seven, try and stop him again. Man, oh man. Under the lights, baby. Come on. As we are just about set to go. You got to want it. You just got to want it, like... <laughs> More than they do. You just gotta want it more than they do. There's no read defender here. I think I can pull this. I'm not going to. I just trust Marlon a little bit more in that situation. Whether or not I should. That's neither here nor there. But here I'm gonna pull it and just cross my fingers. The T can just house this one that time. Back to throw. Teague. throw it for his running back. Throw Teague. The throw, Teague. Looking to throw, Teague. It's caught. Touchdown. J.P. Morgan and Sons. Let's go. Okay. Plays, but it has to be plays that gets first downs and keeps the ball away from your opponent. They're certainly throwing the ball. Thomas now throwing on first down. Good defense. That's 15, right? Second. Okay. Beautiful. Okay. Thomas to throw on second down. And he's going to be brought. On fourth down. Thomas escaping the pressure right. He'll hear this one out from Mims. And he'll get this one out to the fifth. Marlon, can you just host this? Get our defense back in the field. No pressure. One stop wins the game, Marlon. Can you just host this for me, Marlon? All right. Second down now. Branch. What a nice burst. I do I do have some trust in my defense. Not a stupid, stupid amount, but I, I do got trust. To first. He's back to throw. This will be Okay, 25 seconds left. Oh my gosh! 25 seconds left. Can we stop him? Throw a pick, dude. Throw a pick, Evan. Evan, I know you better than anybody knows you ever. Throw a pick for me, Evan Thomas. Good defense, Brett. I knew he was looking at that. Nope. And this is incomplete with a clock. We're going to OT, fellas. Or incomplete pass there is probably the best scenario going because if he yeah, gets three deep game of the year, man. This is this is not this one. This is game of the year by far. Here's Thomas throwing on fourth down. Going deep here for Watkins. <laughs> and did he catch it? He did. A touchdown.
That's a beautiful way to end a beautiful game, man. It's a big win here as they move to so yeah, essentially he can bomb cover three, three deep. I know that now. See how my my deep third safety ran with him, leaving that part of the field completely wide open. JC Horn gets torched. Oh, that's a tough way to go, man. I'm like, hey, look at this game though. 383 for Teague, four touchdowns. 358 for Evan Thomas. Tyreek had buck 95. Pierman had 32. Dang, guys. I would have loved to see that go to OT, but he bombed me. He, he, he freaking dotted us. Evan Thomas gets his revenge on the final play of the game. Wheeler gets an upgrade. Um, he's at an 87 overall. He's getting close to becoming a beast. He's already, he's already a beast. 87. He's had a really good season. I want to key in on that quick. But that might be game of the year. I think that probably was game of the year. Plus one throw power for Teague. Oh my gosh, 93 throw power is ridiculous. Teague's becoming a beast in front of our eyes. That's a tough one to lose that way. Um, it just is. Simple as that. Oh, down the stretch, our one seed. We also have two really tough games coming up. <sighs> okay. Ladies and gentlemen, the show must go on. The show must go on. What a season Teague's having. Tyreek goes crazy for us. I wanted to look at Wheeler um, just to give him kind of a moment. Five and a half, 17 TFLs, and some forced fumbles. He's, he's showing up, but David freaking PR Williams dotted me up. With that. Hey, kill the like button for that game, bro. That's what Madden's about. I just happen to be on the bad side of it this time. We got the Chiefs next week, rematch of the Super Bowl. Let's go. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, boom, fellas. Super Bowl rematch. Um, I'm going to run a different play. I don't, like... I got 23 million. I, I want to bring back Terrence Bramble. Um, I'm going to offer him 4-6, like my 40. Yep. Okay, beautiful. Uh, Avion, I want to bring back. Jamie Divins probably doesn't come back, unfortunately. Avion, I'm going to offer three years, and he's not quite convinced. We'll, we'll figure out some of these guys after. Guys, that was the greatest game ever, that last one. Shout out to other Evan Thomas, bro. That was fun. Like, that was just... The, the simplest way I can put that was that was really, 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 really fun, Madden. But at the end of the day, dude, we freaking lost. Against the Chiefs guy, I'm going to run a different playbook. Um, Seeding-wise, our seeding is somewhat kind of stagnant. Um, the Giants already won, and then the Giants has it. So I don't think we can get the number one seed. Uh, not to say that I'm not going to try in this game. Like That's not at all what I'm saying. Giants won 49-13 um, to 13 against the freaking Eagles. I'll show you guys the Giants' schedule. Who do the Giants end with? Actually, we got to win this. Because we may actually squeak into the tiebreaker. Um, okay. I'm going to run a little bit of a different playbook with Tyree Kill than I usually do. Um, just to try and throw him off a little bit. Stay up, man. Oh, my God. Actually, no. We're going to run our original. Don't, you know what? No, I'm not going to switch. I'm not going to try and reinvent the wheel. This is it, bro. This is the biggest game ever. Rematch of the Super Bowl. Let's go. Now, here's Mahomes. Open man down field is hard. But... Come on, man. Throwing on first down is Mahomes. Finding a safety valve here. That's complete. Okay, keep her, he's got an electric yeah, offense. Play action. Now it's Mahomes. Oh, he's got a man wide. Okay, shade the last game. That was bad. On third down. T. Got him. No. They'll try and throw for it here. It's incomplete. This one, have that on his own sideline and in his locker room. Because yeah. I think the team's going to look at my like, coach. Why would we go for it there? I mean, no confidence in the defense. You know, uh, throwing sure. again on second and ten. Mahomes. And he's got mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, I got to switch defenses. Horrible, horrible, horrible start. Looking to throw. T. They'll roll him out right. There we go, Jake. There we go, Chigozian. Operating from the gun. T. Try to lay one up. He rifles one that's intercepted. Picked up by Juan Thornhill. Room here to run. And they will be set up. So after the INT, here's Mahomes. The kill here, it's complete. Touchdown. Use if this is an important possession, but 
I think this has to be the possession where they come up with an answer because only a few teams in league history ever come back from a four-score deficit. And I'm not saying on that last play, and that we can win that. It, it starts here. Like it, it starts here. Looking to throw. T eluding the pressure right. And this time he's got the line they're going for. They'll look to throw again. JP. JP Morgan and Sons. Okay. Hey, Brett, can you start playing defense, though? Like, seriously? I don't know what it is that you call what we're playing right now. But it, it's not defense. There's no defense being played at the moment. It's just horrendously, horrendously, horrendously bad football. Um, even a stop, score, score after half, we can be back in this game. It's horrible. I'm the first to admit this is not going well. But and it's a pretty good they, they go play action now. Mahomes, he's got Thompson here, complete, and they'll get Mahomes now on first down. There goes a deep ball in zone, and that is caught. <laughs> Good run, Teague. Hey, he's keeping me in the game. From the gun on third down. You got to get the first down. Is that really our only chance right now, guys? Um, lies with we, we pretty well need. If I'm just going to tell you exactly how it is, I need seven right here, and I need seven after half. And if I can, those two things happen, we can win this. But it, it sadly does require both of those things to happen. Midfield strike, they'll look to throw. And just... They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Steps away to his left. And he walking in the average range. On fourth down, T. You can't, it's like, you can't catch a full game now, dude. As they're going to stop him behind the line. They fake the give. Now Mahomes taking a deep Come shot. Come on, Barnes. Good job, Barnes. Cannot be mad at Barnes for that one. Has been executed well. They'll throw again from their own end zone. My brain's off. I wish I was. My brain's off. I, I got nothing. I don't know. Okay, ladies, y'all. I got no face cam. Even is my face cam dead? I got no face cam. Ladies and gentlemen, that was, that was horrible. I got no words for that. GG's to my opponent. I don't know. Next video is playoffs. We just got to bounce. We got to figure this out. We've lied. We, that was just, we got to let that one get away from us. But, oh my gosh. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, 10,000 likes for the playoffs. I don't have a face cam. I got nothing going. Peace. Thank you guys so much for watching. I have a second channel where I post hockey gameplay. Please go subscribe. The nicest thing you did to me, just go check out that channel. Leave a like. Even if you don't like hockey, give it a chance. Subscribe to the channel. Uh, my Instagram is at BrettBQB. My Twitter is TDBearYG. I am a part of Top Dog Madden. You can get all the best tips at topdogmadden.com for your ebooks, all those type of things. Thank you guys so much for watching. Kill the like button again. If you haven't killed the like button on this video, do it. And once again, go check out my hockey.